Hello friends, uh, I have been learning Coral Draw in order to be able to make some illustrations for my medical educational videos and I thought I should share whatever I've been learning. So this is Coral Draw looks like when you first started. You can open a new blank document, you can open some templates and go from there. You can choose not to see the welcome screen and you can also get rid of this screen here now I will open a new blank document this is the size of the page A4 size and this is portrait and I'm looking at 100% of the page so this is my page and you can use middle mouse button if you roll it over you can zoom in so I'm looking at 200% now and uh, roll down will zoom out so I'm looking at 25% of the page so for this illustration I will use 200 times magnified means twice the size of the the actual size and we'll be using uh, interactive fill tool a transparency tool which is part of this group of tools and ellipse tool so left mouse click on your ellipse tool press control button on your keyboard and drag and let go this is a perfect circle this is select tool here and I wanted to make change this shape to look like oval left click on interactive fill tool and hold it from here and drag and drop ok so this part of the tool has black color in it this is white and this is a gradient fill from totally black to totally white and you can move this slider up and down to change the the gradient okay you can also use multiple colors so I want to use yellow here so this part is black and this is yellow and you can again change the the level of it blue maybe here okay sorry and maybe green here and I also want to use maybe orange here okay so this is how you use uh, your interactive fill tool you can use it as a gradient between two colors and you can use it to use multiple colors in your uh, illustrations I also want to get rid of this outline here so I'll go to select tool the object is selected and I'll simply right mouse click and the outline is gone I'll make it a bit smaller and I will click it one more time and I'll rotate it a bit and I'll select it once again I'll press plus sign on my keyboard and these two of these things uh, on top of each other and I'll hold this and I'll drag and drop it down so this object is a complete mirror of this one we want to use transparency tool now so go to this plan here transparency and hold it from here and drop it so 
this is the transparent tool okay so this looks like a reflection of this object we can make it more prominent we can use a rectangle draw a rectangle around this is another object and we will fill it with a darker color maybe black now go to your uh, menus drop down menus arrange order and to back of the page so we have the these two objects in front of this black object now I will again use this transparency tool I'll change so these are all related to this transparency tool I'll go to radial okay and I will just pull the handle back and I'll decrease the radius okay thank you very much